That's Via. Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another live stream. Today, today is June 18th, 2023. And we're doing a patio live stream. Open discussion. Drinks, smokes, cigar, snacks. Probably harvest uh, some goodies from the garden. Uh, we've been harvesting a fair bit of uh, lettuce, uh, dill, basil what else she's all oh, i should have watered this one she <laughs> so i watered the plants this morning uh and uh i've uh, been eating a little bit but there is more to harvest as well we've got some uh snap peas here as well that we can grab here's a snap pea right here been munching on these uh for a couple of days now more than a couple of days you can take off the oh i already took it off i guess yeah yeah i already took it off right there so you can take off the little thing on it and there's a little stringy part that goes off there you can just munch on it very good i'm not sure if we can get it to focus will it focus where there's a little some peas in there Alfie, how are you doing? Good afternoon, good afternoon. On chart today, salutations, hey Chicho and chat. Hope your weekend is going well, indeed. Indeed. I'm still recouping from my Bill Hicks break. <laughs> Alfie, it's 105 degrees in Arizona right now, so no patio for me today. No kidding, crack open the air conditioning and sit back and relax or go swim in the pool. All right base man salutations amazing snack amazing snack amazing snack hello all base man got other snacks as well my partner made some tuna ceviche uh last night super delicious <laughs> super delicious <laughs> like really good i uh, got some apples here but first and foremost let's pour ourselves a drink i'm going with tequila again been sampling this a little bit uh since the last stream right uh very delicious very delicious tequila so let's pour ourselves a little drink while we wait for people to roll in so we got the drink going uh and we light up the cigar um, as soon as we do our little intro i like drinking tequila in this little glass with ice super super nice private 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 Plutonic floors, how are you doing? Alfie, AC, recliner, kitchen, <laughs> kitchen nightmares on the TV, and some strawberries. Nice, that's my Sunday. Very good, very good. You do your strawberries with sugar or uh, whipping cream? We eat our strawberries just straight up, or I make strawberry jam and we munch it that way. Uh, gang, salutations. I hope you're doing well. And as everyone's saying, happy Sunday. I hope you're enjoying uh, your Sunday today. Salute. As far as um, our little intro goes, let's do our little intro. Um, Alfie, I usually eat them straight, but I do enjoy dipping them in some sugar. Yeah, me too. Sometimes I used to do with strawberries. Let's buy a whole bunch, wash them, take off the little ends, the green part, the whatever, the green part. And then cut them all up, put them in a bowl, and then spray sugar on top, right? Or maple syrup. Maple syrup gives it, takes away from the strawberry flavor. I, I prefer sugar. And then mix it, and then put it in the fridge. Let it chill for a bit. The strawberries give out a little juice, so you get a little bit of strawberry syrup at the bottom. And it kicks up, the obviously, the sugar content of the strawberries and sometimes I, I usually if i do that i make a big bowl and the big bowl stays in there for in the fridge for you know two three four days eat strawberries amazing with yogurt amazing with yogurt <laughs> you can eat yourself you can eat his love your maple syrup 100 <laughs> percent. who doesn't love sap that comes from a tree delicious i don't know if it's actually sap like a syrup that comes from a tree fun stuff gang if you want to know what this work is about i'm on patreon mr pinks how are you doing <laughs> oh 
hope you're doing well. As you know, loaded up the UGO cards, uh, the segment anyway, uh, yesterday. Super fun, man. And by the way, uh, from what I looked, the the Yujiro cards, they weren't Japanese, someone mentioned, they were Chinese, I didn't realize that. But from the five or six that we had, two of them were legit uh, Chinese or Japanese Yujiro cards. And I went through the binder again yesterday after loading up the video, and there are some original first editions in there. Um, and um, there's a fair bit of originals in there, which was super cool, super cool. Uh, so but and thank you for uh, the help uh, once you see the fakes you realize so easily picking out the fakes you're like oh yeah that's a fake oh that's a fake oh that's real so it's just like building that experience that knowledge is fantastic 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 uh, thank you for that by the way uh, super fun uh, gang if you know what this work is about I'm on patreon patreon.com forward slash chicho c-h-y-c-h-o you can also follow the work on Substack, on Subscribestar. And for those of you that are supporting this work on Patreon, on Twitch, where we are live streaming. And a handful of you is decreasing <laughs> the number of people <laughs> supporting us on SensorTube. As soon as it goes down to zero, I'll stop mentioning it. But for those of you that are supporting this work on SensorTube and other means, gang, thank you very much for the support. It is in large part because of your support that we're able to do what it is that we are doing and I thank you very much. Um, Alfie Chicho, I'm buying some more uh, Patrick Nigel prints. Soon I'll post them on Gilded um, when I do. Awesome, awesome. Patrick Nigel is the, I don't know, if it's, is it called Minimalist? Uh, I really like his clean line of work. As the, I think that's the one you're talking about, Alfie. Fantastic and beautiful colors. Fantastic artwork, fantastic artwork. Mr. Pink's nice. Good to know there are some uh, first editions there. Uh, then I keep uh, them separate. Also, some good reprints there uh, that are worth a bit too. And you're welcome, man. It was a pleasure. Awesome. And well, at some point, as soon as I set it up, uh, we'll probably do a comic book reading and then uh, start looking at some cards and stuff. And th these will be close up cards looking at them. I'd like to separate them, like you mentioned, right? Yeah, yeah, Alfie. He's the one that did the cover art for Duran Duran. Very distinct style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one I was thinking about. It, minimalist, you would call it, no? Do you call that minimalist? Minimalist, no? Salut. Loving the tequila. Loving tequila. Gang, we do announce these live streams 30 minutes before we go live on Twitter, Minds, VK, Gap, Getter, and substack notes uh you can definitely follow the work there we got wasps and stuff bees flying around sleepy waves how are you doing the milo chicho what's up what's going on uh what tequila is it it's this guy it's the same one from the last stream espolon oops where we go es espolon espolon tequila reposando i don't know what reposando means 100% puro agave. <laughs> I'm doing my best trying to pronounce that stuff. <laughs> Elder God's in the house. Elder God, salutations. Salute, salute. Hope you're doing well, brother. Alfie, honestly, I don't know too much about art to know what to call them, call him, but I consider it minimalist. Okay, awesome, awesome. It then I, I never know how to pronounce this. I then chiha. I then chiha. I then chiha. I then chiha. What we snagging on today? Oh, check this out. Check this out. Allah God will appreciate this too. Any any lover of tuna will love this. My partner made some ceviche yesterday. I made some food, and my partner <laughs> made some food too. This is tuna ceviche. It's got tuna. Uh, some greens herbs from our garden mangoes onion avocado uh, lemon juice um, what else uh, cilantro what else did she put in here I can't remember 
fantastic very yummy very yummy and you don't cook the tuna you let the let it sit and the lemon cooks it up right the lemon juice super delicious super strong flavor mm. 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 so good so good very delicious very delicious super delicious uh, mr. Prinks also if you are interested in collecting some cards some Lord of the Rings magic cards are coming out too might be worth something in the future I remember you saying you own some magic cards yeah 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 Lord of the Rings magic cards like the but still in the magic universe it's just the design as Lord of the Rings I got a uh, I'm actually eyeing some other cards old pre golden age cards uh, from a local sell seller that maybe I'll get my hands on um, I got I got to look into it I'll look into it if you if you're on gilded brother uh, pinks I think you're there uh, oops that's not gilded this is gilded that's SoundCloud where we upload some podcasts and those podcasts are available on your favorite podcasting platform and we do have a gilded server so uh, pinks I'm, I'm pretty sure 100 almost that you're on gilded if you link it up for us on uh, maybe collectibles or comic books uh, I might decide to start ordering some stuff because I'm still not going to the comic book store so I'll have to find other means of acquiring them right baseball I believe Raposado is aged longer than Anajo. Oh, is that what it is? Mm. So the white one is the Anajo? They have a white bottle as well. Well, not white bottle, but the tequila is white. This is yellow. So this is the longer aged one, maybe. I think they have three different styles of this, this company. I haven't eaten durian yet. Uh, plutonic Polaris sleepers I've, I love ceviche oh my god so good so good homemade su ceviche more superior 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 baseman ceviche incredible Alfie I had the best ceviche when my wife and I stayed uh, stayed in Playa del Carmen Mexico a couple of years ago delicious fresh fish just scrolling down gang uncharted days how are you doing speaking of snacks have you got any plans to do cooking streams this summer oh for sure we're going to do cooking streams on charter days 100 percent 100 percent um i'm just waiting for the school season to be over i'm sort of uh running on fumes right now at the end of the year uh so really don't have the energy to put out everything together and do a cooking stream once the school season over my plate almost becomes clear then we'll go hardcore right for sure cooking streams sleep away chicho did your birthday already pass indeed i'll see chicho what is your opinion on what i posted in gilded oh yeah i agree with it 100 percent here gang let me take this stuff down oh yeah gang uh I know we're about to take call well, actually let's talk about comic books uh, Alfie posted something regarding uh, Jack Kirby because a documentary came out on Stanley I forget I think Disney documentary came out on Stanley on Disney and in the documentary I haven't watched it yet there's a lot of I Stanley saying I did this I did this I created this I co-created this I da, 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 da. and that's what Stanley was known for right taking credit for everything under the fucking Sun right huge respect to Stanley for having the vision to still put his energy into comic books right no problem good manager right good manager good marketer good mascot right however majority of comic book characters created for marvel, marvel comics by a long shot hands down woo, leaps and bounds above anybody else including stanley was jack kirby anybody in the comic book medium everybody in the comic book medium that knows anything about comics knows this 100 percent jack kirby got shafted 
right literally by the comic book corporations mainly marvel comics which is one of the reasons by the way that what the comic book companies did to jack kirby was was sort of a precedent right something that they did and it was the catalyst that gave birth to independent comic book creators right todd mcfarland has been quoted as saying the reason he went independent outside of the uh, main corporations and one of the main reasons that they started image comics where comic book creators would retain the rights to their own comics and can keep their art and all this jazz was because of what happened to jack kirby right horrendous horrendous and jack kirby man fucking one of the greatest minds in uh, contemporary I mean he passed away in 1994 but it, greatest creators greatest imaginations in history human history we're talking about right and that's the way the corporations treated him right so there's a lot to be said there regarding what Jack Kirby's son wrote about the Stanley documentary right which is saying that man uh, Stan Lee is full of shit and he was anyone in the comic book medium knows this he took credit for everything right huge credit needs to be given to Jack Kirby he was the main creator he, he was really uh, the reason why Marvel Comics is what it is right in terms of uh, comic book characters the universe building and all that jazz going on stanley had a huge part in it in marketing right and they go hand in hand they were partners but when one partner starts taking credit for the work of another partner you gotta call them out you gotta call them out so alfie 100 jack kirby's son is 100 accurate and he said it more eloquently than i did right um he was more generous to stanley than i would be tell you the truth um so that's my take on it uh aside from that because we covered that that's comic books this is an open discussion gang as a patio garden live stream i'm gonna be smoking a little cigar oh yeah as far as the cigar goes i haven't smoked one of these i haven't smoked the quava for over 20 years and i'm fucking looking forward to this really we're gonna have a smoke here uh if you are watching this intro segment on sensor tube i'm sorry gang open discussion we can't load this on sensor tube you want to go to bit rumble and odyssey and just give you an example how horrendous sensor tube is uh, mike tyson just started uploading to rumble because sensor tube censored an interview he did with robert f kennedy jr right so sensor tube is titanic going down sinking fucking hard you want to experience life as a free thinking human being you want to be on picture rumble odyssey that's where you want to be so that's where we're going full live stream links in the description of this video